From college hoops to college volleyball, UT Brownsville gets the big win today in Pool E play. 3-0 the final. Next up, UTB will face Southern Oregon 1 o'clock tomorrow in Sioux City, Iowa. UTB is playing at the tournament knowing it's the last season for the program due to the UTRGV merger. Meanwhile, UTPA volleyball in a state of flux as well. Today, the university fired head coach Brian Yale after four seasons. Yale 37 and 86 over the last four years, 5 and 25 in the WAC. Now UTRGV Athletic Director Chris King has a decision to make. Does he call 65 miles to the southeast to Ocelot's coach Todd Lowry? He's got four national titles, looking for a fifth, and he'll need a job at the end of the school year. He says to the Sioux City News this week, I'm trying to get through this week, and then he has some tough decisions to make with his career. He says that there maybe there will be an opportunity to stay with UTRGV, but as of this time, it hasn't presented itself. He's just waiting to finish up the year, putting everything he can into that. Stay tuned on that story.